Welcome to all the uh, Mini Enthusiasts, Classic Car Enthusiasts. So there's the head off. Um, and that you can still even see the number four written on the piston and one. So uh, Max has uh, got it sorted. Uh, I mean he's up to, oh he's putting, he's putting the hinge brackets in. I mean he's yeah. doing that and then we're going to uh, hopefully put everything back together. Um, yeah, one of the things was is with this as well, is you definitely need to take these arches off to, to stick them, but because of the way the stuff's stored, you know, it's all, it's in kind of, um, uh, it's, you know, it's, it's, it's set in on a, on a hoop, if you like, and it makes the, the, the rubber all a bit, a bit um, uh, out of shape. So what we're doing is we're putting them on for a few weeks, and then we'll take them off and redo them. And you can see the perfect example of that here. You can see it looks quite nice there, and then there's a little bit gammy. So we're gonna what he's done is he's got them in and, and tightened them up a little bit, and then we'll either tighten them up a bit more, get them get them set right, and then do one at a time. Yeah. yeah. So so basically what we're doing is training them, if you like. Anyway, so you can see everything's off. Um, the maestro's working on the head at the moment. And uh, there she is. So it's uh, this is what it was. This tool here, this reamer that Max is going to hold, he's had this one for 20 years. 20 years he's had it, and it's failed. Terrible, isn't it? Eh? Technology, <laughs> engineering, and what it is now. Obviously, it's now under under reaming or it's cutting. So he's got this this one here, which is a an adjustable reamer, and now they're all spot on the money. So um, obviously that one's going to have to be redundant, I guess, or use it for some other job. So I'm going to put all the head back together now, and, and uh, hopefully we'll fire it up in the next few hours or whatever. So yeah, uh, lastly, uh, I want to show you this binnacle, and you can see I've cleaned all the plastic and out on the white. Oh, what's happened? There? How did that get inside? I'll have to take that glass back off again. When you're doing these, you need to be dead careful with the. Hang on a second. I'll put my cigarette out. Uh, when you're taking these off, because this one here is separate and these two are, are together, the, the the plastic. But you need to be very careful. Make sure that you open them up. Put, pull those clips there. Push them all in and make sure they're all clicked in. And before you try and lift them off, or you'll snap them. They're very easy. What I'll do is I'll get the airline on it now and just give it a clean out and take them off again. Get all the dust and crap out of it. But what, what, what we're doing here is actually putting this binnacle in, and this is the way it's supposed to fit, right up against the fascia there, and you can see it's got the sponge on it already, but I'll get all the dust and crap out of it now. And then basically you're just screwing that down to to the wood fascia. What The way the guy had it was, it was still attached to the, the binnacle um, bracket, if you like, and then it was sitting off like this, which is not the one, it looks awful. You know, you have to take all this off and, and reattach it to, to the wood itself. And you can see if I turn it over, you can see how nice that's going to look. There's a few scratches and things on it, but it's, it's, uh, it'll come up, I think. It's a bit dark for what I would have, but the last one I had was much much uh, lighter wood than that. This is a kind of dark stain, but it, it looks so much nicer on the binnacle when, it's, when there's no gap there. Anyway, so... Uh, yeah, so we'll get back to you in a couple of hours, and uh, we'll go from there. So, oh, I've got the seat seats done now. They're on their frames. You can see they're going to look really nice together. Um, unfortunately, one of the side covers is broken. It's uh, they, they snapped the pieces of plastic in there. This is the side cover for it, and you can see. Unfortunately, I'll bring it out into the light a bit. Bring it in, you can see it. You can see that this is this is snapped off. So I'll get some new ones sent, and this is half of one. I think it was a little bit. Ah, oh, there's the other half of it. It must have been done in transit, I would guess. But you can see. So I'll get a couple of those sent out and we can put them back on. But the nice thing about these seats is you've got your normal handles to go in and out on the runners. 
then you've got your handle to open up your lever to go in the back and then you have your adjustable recliner here so you can you can you can recline them as well and these are nice too because they you just turn them you just turn like that and you can pull it up a click and then it locks back in or you can have it the other way and push it down so anyway that's it uh, We'll catch you in a few hours. I'm enjoying the update, but they're really nice. The frames look lovely on that. It's exactly the same fittings as the original ones, uh, where they hinge on the front on the the box section, the box strengthener going across the car. Anyway, catch you soon. Bye for now. Bye.